What are the main qualified plans? I'm here to help. My name is Kenner French. I'm with Vast Solutions Group, your tax and financial engineering firm for small business owners. We work with clients all over the country and have been in existence for 50 years with many happy clients. To see some of our clients' comments, please go to our website, www.vastsolutionsgroup.com. Now, what are the various types of qualified plans? Here we go. You know, first you have the defined benefit plan. A defined benefit plan, it's funded by the employer. It promises a specific monthly benefit at retirement. You can potentially state the promised benefit as an exact dollar amount, such as $100 a month at retirement, as an example. Or more often, it may calculate your benefit through a formula that includes factors such as your salary, your age, your number of years you've worked at a company. Now, as an example, your pension benefit might be equal to 1% of your average salary for the last five years of employment. Now, that would be times your total years of service as an example. Now, let's go to a 401k, a little easier to understand. In this type of what's called a defined contribution plan, the employee makes contributions or defers his or her paycheck before taxes are taken out. The contributions or deferrals go into a 401k account, with the employee often choosing the investments based on options provided under the plan. In some plans, the employer also makes contributions, matching the employee's contributions up to a certain percent. Simple. Safe Harbor 401k plans also have additional employer contributions investing requirements. Now what's a profit sharing plan? A profit sharing plan allows the employer each year to determine how much to contribute to the plan out of profits or what have you in cash or other employee stock, employer stock. The plan contains a formula for allocating the annual contribution amongst the participants who can participate in an employer's retirement plan once you've learned what type of retirement plan your employer offers, you need to find out when you can participate in the plan and begin to earn benefits. Plan rules can vary as long as they meet requirements under federal law. You need to check with your plan or review the plan booklet, which is actually called a Summary Plan Description or SPD, to learn your plan's rules and requirements. Your plan may require you to work for the company for a period of time before you may participate in the plan. In addition, there are typically, it's a time frame for when you begin to accumulate benefits and earn the right to those benefits. Sometimes it's revert, referred to as a vesting schedule. Find out if you are within the group of employees covered by your employer's retirement plan. Federal law allows employers to include certain groups of employees and exclude others from a retirement plan. Now, for example, your employer may sponsor one plan for salaried employees or for another for union employees. Part-time employees may be eligible for three if they work at least 1,000 hours per year, which is about 20 hours per week. So if you work part-time, you need to find out if you're covered. Now, each retirement plan is required to have a form of what's called a plan document. It's a written plan document that details how it operates in its requirements. As noted previously as above, there is also a booklet that describes the key plan rules called the SPD summary plan description, which should be much easier to read and understand. The SPD also should include a summary of any material changes to the plan or to the information required to be in the SPD. In many cases, you can start with the SPD and then look at the plan document if you still have questions because it can be a little complex. Now, can you borrow from a 401k account? 401k plans are permitted, but not required to offer loans to participants. The loans must charge a reasonable rate of interest and be adequately secured. The plan must include a procedure for applying for the loans and the plan's policy for granting them. Loan amounts are limited to a lesser of 50% of your account balance or 50,000, except for during the coronavirus issue, because it's double that. Loans have to be paid back over five years. Now, if you have any questions specifically about any of the materials I've just discussed, please check us out on the web. As I mentioned before, our website is www.vastsolutionsgroup.com or you can give us a call at 888-808-8278. We'd be happy to help in any way we can. If this material or any material you find on the website, etc., is of interest to you or someone else, please once again, Give us a call and we'll be happy to help if we can in any way.